Hey you guys, I am coming on today to do a makeup haul. Now I know y'all are thinking, this heifer said her next video is going to be her flat twist and flexi rod. So yeah, I know that. But when I, I do a lot of impromptu stuff. I, all right, so yes, I had to put the baby close by y'all. So y'all, I showed y'all my hair edges. Um, in my last video, my hair is slowly but surely coming around. I'll give it another three or four weeks and my hair will be back to where it was um, before I got pregnant. So, I recently, just like yesterday, <laughs> went to uh, Walgreens and, not Walgreens, um, Albertsons. <clears throat> I was grocery shopping and when I went down, I kind of looked down the makeup owl well and i saw nothing but yellow tags when you see that that means that stuff is on sale on clearance i mean the whole lane was nothing but yellow tags so i went down I'm like, well, let me see what they have going on they had great deals on the wet and wild products now wet and wild products are already cheap but um i got some really good deals so let me show y'all what i so the first makeup palette i got is called i got good jeans and in here you have a shimmery gold, a dark brown, which is like a jean color, and then the um, light brown. One thing I do say about Wet n Wilds is that it shows you where you could apply the particular eyeshadow. Um, I don't normally follow this. I do whatever I want. So I really do love this, this, um, these colors. I intentionally bought this for an event I'm going to. It kind of matches the shirt I'm wearing. Um, I'm not wearing anything from this one. The next one I have is Walking on Eggshells. This is a shimmery neutral palette. The bottom one, the eyelid is more of a shimmery pink, and then the crease is more of a mocha, and the brown bone, the brow bone color is an eggshell color. Very pretty. What are you doing? Um, the next one is Cool as a Cucumber. Now, I will say this. I want to show you all the applicators they provide. They provide these two applicators. They're kind of cute, huh? Um, the eyeshadow one, then they have one for blending. Y'all, I can't, I, can't, I can't do nothing. This, I, I, can't, I can't do nothing with this. So, yeah, this is how little they are. I, yeah. Cool. cool as a cucumber. You have the eyelid, the crease. And then the brown bone, the brow bone color is more of a pale green. So let me tell y'all what I am wearing, and let me get up on the camera as far as eyeshadows go. Um, so I will say this before I tell you my honest opinion: this is what I'm wearing, and you really can't tell. So, hmm. I am wearing this bottom and middle color and the crease purple color, this eggplant color. I don't really care for this palette, the neutral palette. Don't really care for it is not as it's I don't know I would prefer this neutral palette the I love matte by wet and wild sorry I'm holding that funny so yeah I don't really care for that and I also I had to apply the eggplant crease to give a little bit more pop I'm thinking that this will look great on someone who has lighter skin um, but because I am chocolate this really isn't showing up as great I would hope. Now, as far as the blush goes, I bought this Berry Shimmer. Very pretty. And that is pretty. See how that, that's like a slight pink color? Berry Shimmer. And I went over it with my NYX Terracotta. Okay? Love this. And this is not the first time I've had tried their um, blush. Then the Mega Protein Mascara. Don't really care for this. It's cheap. I mean, it is cheap. Uh, I would rather spend seven and eight dollars, ten dollars on a really good mascara. So, how much did all this cost? Well, the eyeshadows 
um, were only 172. I, I don't know how they came up with these prices, but 172 for the eyeshadows, um, 172 for the mascara, and then I think like two bucks for the eyeshadow. And then for overall, I think I did good. I, I've been looking for some more fall colors, and I think, you know, combining these with what I already have, it will work out. Um, but as you can see, I mean, obviously I have an eyeshadow, but it's not as, I wanted a little bit more. I was expecting a little bit more, but I think because of my skin tone, I just have to work with what I have. So, all right, you guys, my next videos will be either the flat twist out or I'm going to go ahead and do those flexi rods. I'm a little bit nervous, but. I might as well go ahead and get it done. So anyway, um, thank you guys for watching and thank you again to all of my new subscribers. Bye.